Hi, I'm Toby for block 2 social and I welcome you to this short walkthrough of our WordPress plugin. block 2 social is a social media automation tool and allows you to automatically share all your blog posts to your connected social media networks. For that, you have two general options. The first is our auto posting feature. Uh, once enabled, you can share your blog posts on all your connected networks, depending on your chosen network settings, but more on that later. Your second option, however, is our customize and scheduling feature. Just a click on the respective button and you are led to our one-step workflow. That's an overview of all, your, of all the functions you need to make your post ready for the social web so you can manage your connected networks here, customize your postings and specify a scheduling scheme. However, I'll show you each function in turn. So let's just start with the network settings. Here on the right side, you can see all your connected networks and you can select or deselect each network um, with just a simple click like I'm, like I'm doing right here. Um, if you want to deselect uh, all the accounts you don't need right now, just do so and you can, for example, save your settings. That's especially helpful if you want to address, for example, just your Twitter followers or your fans on Insta and Pinterest only. And as you can see here, we have a special network settings for our uh, international Twitter account for block to social so we don't have to deselect or select um, the needed networks every time we want to post something and um, we can just um, load in the specific settings and you can add and you can add up to 15 different profiles pages or groups per network just with a simple click on the um, add more button on the one page workflow and you will be led to this overview right here where you can add several profiles pages and groups like I said before you can add um, Twitter profiles, Facebook profiles and pages, Google Plus profiles, pages and groups, LinkedIn profiles, pages, Xing profiles, pages and groups, and for Tumblr, Medium, Toriel, Instagram, Pinterest, Flickr, Diego, and Delicious, you can add uh, up to 15 different profiles. And I connected, for example, three times the same Twitter account just to be more flexible when I schedule a post or want to share the same article but with a different text, which leads me direct to the next function of block to social our customization feature. You can customize, you can customize each and every post for all your connected and uh, selected networks. And block to social ensures that your postings will be shown in the right format for each network. That for example, your Instagram pics will be just in the right scale and your Tumblr posts adjusted to the network's special settings. And however, you should really make use of this feature because not only each network is different, but each community reacts different to a special kind of posts. On Twitter, for example, hashtags and handles drastically increase your engagement rate and your outreach. So you should make sure to include at least one hashtag in each of your postings. Uh, like here, for example, I add um, hashtag social media. And the same applies for hashtags on Instagram and Pinterest. And whereas, for example, short postings work best on Facebook, technical topics, technical topics with more detailed posts work best on uh, Google+, just to name a few examples. However, now that we are done with customizing our blog posts, you can either share your postings immediately, just with a click on the share button, to all your connected networks, or you can set a specific scheduling scheme. You can either publish right now on a one-time or on a recurring scheduling scheme, up to 52 weeks in advance and you can also apply your time settings for all your connected networks and you can save your adjustments we for example we have a, um, a set scheme for our twitter postings because we analyzed our community and looked into the most active times when our most of our followers online and so on and so on and saved the respective times so every time we want to publish a post, we can just click on my time settings and block to social retrieves our previously saved schedule. So we don't have to um, uh, so we don't have to reselect it every time we want to post something. And I can just recommend the same um, to you. If you uh, individually schedule your postings, you should definitely make yourself familiar with your community's preferred online times. This way you just ensure a maximum of engagement and outreach or simply put, you just make sure that your tweets and posts will be seen on the respective networks. That takes a lot of effort, I know, but the outcome is definitely worth your time. And if you don't have that time right now or you just want to get an idea of the best times to post, uh, you can also use the Block2Social best time scheduler. 
for that we analyzed hundreds of profiles for the best times to post on all um, available networks and with the best time scheduler block to social provides you with the results of that analysis so that your postings will be shared at the right times on each network whereby we are at the last but not least feature of block to social just choose the block to social icon on your wordpress dashboard and choose the posts and sharing option here you have an overview of all your already shared postings, your planned but not yet published posts and your drafts also. And you can either arrange them by author, by category and tag, post type or status. And you can also republish your older posts and just click on shared postings. And here you have uh, the reshare this post option. For example, if you want to republish one of your older and golden blog posts on Twitter or to the republishing networks, Medium, Tumblr and Toriel. And if you want to keep track of your activities, we have an, a detailed reporting function that's a list of all your published postings with the respective author and um, the link that shows you the respective posting on the respective network. And that's it. That was our walkthrough of block to social Thanks for watching. I'm Toby. And make sure to follow us on Twitter or on Facebook for many more tutorials, tips and guides. Bye.